So we're here at Garner's World Live, and this is the breakdown. This is the bit you don't want to do, having to put all that hard work into building a garden. It's a bit like the apprentice in the cafe where you've lost the task. Feels a bit like that, but it's got to be done. And the good news is about this garden is it's going to a charity called Whispering Trees, so to do with mental health. So when you create a garden uh, today, it's always good to have where's it going to go afterwards. So. I'm afraid there's going to be a lot of uh, jackhammers, there's going to be a lot of taking out plants and seeing how, how we put things together and can we dismantle them. So uh, we'll see how we go during the day. So this is the last look at the metamorphosis garden. Uh, so it's just about holding it together with the camera. <laughs> So here's the guys, they're uh, putting the level two students who are taking down the garden. They've, uh, this is the first thing to do is to get your plants out and to get them all potted up. So it's just a reverse of how you created the garden. Doing a good job, guys. So this is the human caterpillar. This is what we do. We've got the chain going. That's one way of getting the plants on, and we're stacking them up in the back of the van. Of course, there's lots of aspects to break down, including a lot of forklift truck and manitous diggers. So you can see Darren's uh, flick, flicking up the slabs. Now, what we do. We don't actually lay the slabs properly for a show because if you put SRB under them, they would stick and pull the hole. <laughs> so what we do is we just bed them on wash sand cement five to one, but without using the glue so that they pop up and you can reuse them for another area, which keeps the sustainability good. So we've done the nice bit. We've taken out the top of the pergola. We stripped out the plants. And now we've got to right, start the heavy mob now because I've got to start to kango out those posts. Uh, so it starts to get a bit harder. Jeans. Got a few more posts to break down. In terms of show gardens, um, Dutch trolleys are a really good thing if you've got them. You can stack two, three high without damaging your plants, and that's what you want to do make the maximum use of whatever van you've got. Oh, so, yeah, so we're about done really. Uh, the diggers are going to knock down the walls, so we haven't got to do that, thank goodness. <laughs> and, uh, but you've got to bear all this in mind when you're doing a show garden, so it's uh, it's not for the faint-hearted. And if you're certainly uh, part of a team, then do make sure you're there for. If you can be for part of the breakdown, it's all part and parcel of it. And uh, the the level two guys have done a great job, so we're really pleased with all their help. And uh, so we'll we'll go back to the drawing board and see what we're going to do for next year with Lydia Prime MS Society and Derby College. So just want to say thanks to Bob and to Lucy for organising the event for the caps on the diggers and the forklifts uh, and the uh, tally handlers for all their help. Uh, they, they, they are just sort of such a big help when you're doing a show like this. Okay.